Tracers are used in oil and gas reservoirs to keep track of fluid movements. A typical scenario is that you want to extract oil by replacing the produced volumes by water. This water may end up in any of your producers. Sometimes this movement from injector to producer is surprisingly fast, other times it can take years. In any case, the tracers are the only way to directly prove mass movement from injector to producers. This is done by injecting a short pulse of unique tracers in each of your injectors and to monitor the produced water in the production wells. Detection of a tracer in a producer proves communication from the relevant injector and that producer. By tracking all of the injectors with different tracers, all injector producer communications can be mapped out in the reservoir. In addition to establishing the existence of connections, traces can also be used to quantify the significance of each of the connections. This is done by calculating the produced tracer mass in each producer, simply by multiplying the concentration, that is the mass per volume, to the production rate, volume per time, and summing up for the whole tracer curves. Comparing the produced tracer mass to that injected then gives us the percentage of tracer produced. Because tracer behave exactly as the water itself, this percentage gives us a direct measurement of how much of the injected water ended up in a given producer. 10% produced tracer means that 10% of your injected water ended up in that particular producer. Finally, the tracer curves also give you information of the volume affected by the injected fluid. This can be realized by noting that tracers measure the time it takes to move from one point to another point in the reservoir. When tracers are injected at a specific date, the first occurrence gives the breakthrough time. The typical time spent by tracers are given from the peaks characteristic for tracer curves. And we can also find the average time spent by the tracers in the reservoir. Combined with the fraction of the injection rate moving towards that particular producer, these times give us the volume explored by the tracers and hence the volume affected or swept by the injected fluids. In summary, interval tracers is a cost-effective tool that gives unique insight of the movements of fluid in the reservoir. It can be used to reveal the source of any detrimental short water breakthrough or to quantify the efficiency of water or gas injections.